This is your boy, D. And this is your girl, Jasmine. Today, we are going to talk to you all about the Zika virus. And I know that sounds very stupid, because to me it does. But the Zika virus, what it is, is it's a virus transmitted through mosquitoes. Oh, really? Yes, and other animals. I hate mosquitoes. I hate mosquitoes, too. Yeah. For any of you all that really like mosquitoes, you're a mosquito yourself. I don't yourself. think there is none. No. Mosquitoes are very pointless. They are. They're, out of all the beings that live, what's the point of mosquito? Like, you know, spiders can be helpful because they eat mosquitoes. But mosquitoes, what, what do they help me do? I thought about that and I was like, man, maybe I should have got a pet spider. But I don't like spiders either. So, I only want... spider. Yeah, I mean, if it could go around my room and just, you know, get up all my bugs, like, I would like that. Or if I could have, oh, I don't like spiders. So if I could have like, like the, you know how they have like a little spray or something like a little, like a little um, candle or something. You know what I'm talking about. And like, it would get rid of like all bugs, like somehow, like the scent or something. Oh yeah, you're talking about the candle that can like get rid of all bugs and it has can some kind that? of scent. Is there a real one? Like what you just said. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. That those, those exist. Those do exist. They do? Yeah, it's a... Man, I need one of those. Well, I don't have bugs. Then what's your point? Well, if I were to have bugs, then I don't want it. Well, there's stink bugs. I hate stink bugs. But yeah. I wouldn't want it laying around, though. I would want to, like... I feel like if I were to find a bug, like... Like, what if it, like... What if it just got, like... Killed the bugs that came inside? And then there'd just be bugs laying around? Sorry, but stink bugs are always going to end up in your house somewhere. But anyway, I've got this is that, article. Is that only in certain regions? Is that everywhere? I think. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know either. I don't like the way they smell when they kill them. I try to, like, I try to put, like, get a paper towel and crush it right there. Mm -hmm. And then throw it away. That's like, like, close it. Not, like, close it and then open it and smell it. And just kind of, like, like, what the Right. Okay, good. Keep going. Sorry. That's okay, baby girl. Don't be sorry. Yes, I have this article on CNN, and it says Zika may be now linked to serious eye abnormality, normal maladies mm -hmm. that could be lead that could that could lead to blindness oh. in Brazilian newborns with microcephaly. Cephaly. What is this look like? Microcephaly. Cephaly. I don't know. You, you get anyway, this. yeah. What do I have to say about that? It's it's strange because they say Brazilian newborns. So you automatically think, hey, this virus is just in Brazil. But, but it was spread, I heard, like in Africa and uh, a few other places. But so far, there's no, you know, there's no incidents here of mosquitoes having... The Zika virus. But as far as you know. As far as I know. Plus it's cold right now. So there's no mosquitoes trying to bite me. But during the summertime, they're going to try to bite me. But um, yeah, for anybody who lives in Brazil and all that stuff, I just hope you guys carry your insect repellents, your mosquito whappers, you know, whoppers. Sometimes I feel like those off things don't work. I like off, but sometimes I just feel like like, I don't know, maybe I, I spray it and then I get paranoid, you know? Well, the thing is, you probably just got to drench yourself and all. I used to just... Drench? Not like take a bath. I mean, like... Okay. <laughs> that'd probably be bad for your skin. But... Probably, would, yeah. Like, I used to, like, just pull up my arm sleeve. Not mm -hmm. not pull up my arm. That doesn't make sense. Pull up my sleeve or if I was I had sleeveless sleeveless. I feel like it, you, it should be sleeveless if it's well, that high. Okay. Yeah, that's what I meant. But mm -hmm. I just spray it everywhere. And I rub it in, and I spray it some more. Just make sure you don't get in your eyes, or you know, just, you know, it might be strong. If you, I feel like if you did all of that, you might be strong in your nose. Your nose might start burning, like you know. It has before. Mhm. Mm yeah, you shouldn't do that, babe. It wasn't good. It was. I sprayed so much of it, you know, a little. 
particles. They went into my nose. Ew. I sneezed. See? And on my arm. Ew. So, so not only do you have off on your arm, you got snot. Right. Off. No mosquito would want to be no. on my arm after that. I don't know. I no. wouldn't even want to touch your arm after that. Yeah. Yeah. No touchies. Mm -mm. Mm. It's okay. It's okay. I don't know which arm was that. Who's this arm? Yes. Well. But anywho and anyways and any other ways possible. Any house. Yes, any house. That's the Zika virus. That's but so much more. That's all I hear about it. It's not really that crucial mm -hmm. yet, you know, but it's like the common cold, you know. It's something that can be treated, but probably like antibiotics and stuff like that. But you can look up more about it and just tell me what you think about mosquitoes and how bad they are in our society and that you know they all need to be locked up and we need locked up killed you want to lock how are you gonna lock up a mosquito lock just up put it in the cage lock. like use it for scientific research all of them you don't need all of them but you know what okay i want to say it reminds me of that plague game that we played on on the like on the Thing. Right. Um, that, yeah, that the plague is uh, called Plague Inc. I think you start your own disease and you can name it, and then you have to reach a certain uh, like all the countries at uh, like a certain number of time or something. Yeah, you make your own virus, bacteria, whatever, and it spreads, and it's, it's super fun. It's, it's fun. fun. It sounds bad. It sounds horrible. Mm -hmm. But it was super fun just to just to because you get to add symptoms and you get to add like. What was it like? Just different stuff. Like you right. get to add where where it goes through. Like if it's transmitted through mosquitoes, does it transmitted through animals? Like, and you just keep adding points every time a person died. It sounds so bad, right? It sounds terrible. It sounds very bad, but it was a very fun game. It's fun. It's but destroying think, the world is fun on that game. Mhm. Mm Only for a game though, but. Yeah. You know, it was it was very fun just to just to see how wide like how quickly it could spread and where it couldn't spread to because it had like 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 it will tell you it'll have a little news thing and it'll tell you like they stopped like air trans you know air travel you know from different mm -hmm. countries just because they don't want it hit in another place and one time it was very hard to it hit Iceland because they only had like one shipping dock or something it was very weird it was crazy yeah every country was infected everyone was dead except iceland yeah i don't understand but anyway <laughs> <laughs> thank you all for watching the video yeah and um leave a comment be sure to subscribe to the channel check us out on facebook and um tell us what you think about the zika virus please look into that because it could spread here mm -hmm. in america and Boy, we all know how much we hate mosquitoes. And yes. if you don't hate mosquitoes, huh, you you should hate mosquitoes. Something's <laughs> wrong with you, so you should hate mosquitoes. But anyway, this is your boy, D. And this is your girl, Jasmine. See. Bye.